This is 11 WTTW Public Television for Chicago. The following program is a stereo simulcast with WBBM-FM. To take full viewing and listening advantage of this transmission, tune your stereo receiver to 96.3 FM and place one speaker on each side of your television set. Now it's you, is it? We've been waiting all night for you. Sit down. Here we go. Okay, Skipper. Ready when you are. Yeah. You ready, old chap? Good. Hello there. Yes, ready when you are. Crimson. Okay, you ready? You want me to cue them? Tonight, from Chicago, Soundstage. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. It's nice to be on soundstage. Nice to see you all here tonight. 
Oh, thank you, Mother. And Father. Yes, they're both here tonight. Oh, they're all here. Yes. The whole family. We'd like those to... Uh, who were, those who weren't invited have flown in. <laughs> We'd like to do a new track from our new album. The album's called Main Course. The track is called Edge of the Universe. Thank you.
event of something happening to me. There is something I would like you all to see. It's just a photograph of someone that I knew. Have you seen my wife, Mr. Jones? Do you know what it's like on the outside? Don't go talking too loud, you'll cause a landslide, Mr. Jones. I keep straining my ears to hear a sound Maybe someone is digging underground Or have they given up and all gone home to bed Thinking those who once existed must be dead Have you seen my wife, Mr. Jones? Do you know what it's like on the outside? Don't go talking too loud, you'll cause a landslide, Mr. Jones. In the event of something happening to me, there is something I would like you all to see. It's just a photograph of someone that I knew Have you seen my wife, Mr. Jones? Do you know what it's like on the outside? Don't go talking too loud, you cause a landslide, Mr. Jones
something I think's worthwhile If the puppet makes you smile If not, then you're throwing stones Throwing stones Throwing stones Dee, 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 dee Dee, 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 dee Dee, 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 dee Dee, 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 dee Just a happy guy Then you often got This feeling that Possesses me I just can't prove myself I guess it all Just had to be mining disaster was there anything especially that inspired you to write this song like 
There's no actual meaning. We found out there was a mining disaster in the state of New York about 1935, but that was after we wrote the song. And, uh, <laughs> but uh, we actually wrote the song in the back steps of Polydor Records in England, uh, in the dark. So it, we, had that we had that atmosphere in the first place. Well, plus the fact the that they wouldn't let us in the studio. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's true. Uh, you, you have a song about our town. Uh, and one of the lyrics in there says, if you're living in Chicago, you're alone. Is there any story behind that? Uh, uh, do you really feel... It, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> do you really feel that uh, if you're living in Chicago, you're, you're alone? Or? I, I, had a, I knew someone was going to ask me this question. I don't know. Really, this is the truth. I'm not kidding you. I knew you were going to ask about that, but I haven't got an answer. No, um, we're not living in Chicago when we were in L.A. Uh, <laughs> it's the truth, but we weren't thinking of L.A. at the time. <laughs> no, we've, we've got Chicago. We wrote Massachusetts and New York, you know. Yeah, we did. So I don't and know. we got a letter from the, uh, is it the mayor of Boston? Yes. Yeah. Saying, thank you, boys. Uh, for, Thanks, for, for our fair little state. I mean, it's sort of mentioned about our fair state or something. Nobody's ever written a song about Massachusetts before. I think they have. You can't chop your mama up in Massachusetts. <laughs> <laughs> but I, don't, mm. I, can't. I don't think it's any kind of... Um, National anthem for that state. Oh, yeah. No, no he didn't mean that. <laughs> no. We never heard from him again, mind you. <laughs> I think it's only down here, sir. I understand you started out at the Manchester Cinema uh, 20 years ago. How did that come about? Well, uh, what happened is that in those days, well, in between after the serial, when the, the main film came on, kids used to get up and mine to records, and uh, like uh, Elvis Presley records and the very early sort of rock and roll Bill Haley records and so forth. Yes. And uh, we saw one kid do it once and we'd like to have got up there. So I'm thinking of all of those songs. Um uh, Lollipop. Lollipop. Yeah, don't think Lolly my, Pop. my voice is broken now. Lollipop is one of the songs he used to sing. Oh, when she does the crazy rockin' dance, man, I haven't got a chance. I call her lollipop, 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 the first earliest songs of the Neil Sedaka song, wasn't it? Tra la 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 Happy birthday, sweet sixteen Tra la 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 Happy birthday, sweet sixteen Tonight's the night I've waited for Because you're not a baby I can't believe my eyes, you're just a teenager. Happy birthday, sweet 16. What happened to that funny face? That little tomboy looks all sad in a lace. I can't believe my eyes. Just a teenager Happy birthday, sweet 16 I missed yeah. that one <laughs>
Now we're going to do a quick impression of the Hudson Brothers.
Uh...